I'm Steph. I'm Michael. Today we're going to check out Equinox. Or Equinox. Hmm. Hmm. A... Now, this is not to be confused with the other game called Equinox. Yeah, this is the they're... brand new. The brand new. From Plan B Games. But is it brand new? Well, Some... that's a question. So, like, uh, other people have, like, said that this is sort of like uh, Titan the Arena and um, Colossal, Arena. Colossal, Ar Colossal Arena, Titan the Arena. Yes, both of those. This is a, a game designed by Rainer Knizia. Yeah. So. And out by Plan B Games. And plays from, uh, is it one to five, uh, two to five? Is it two to five? Mm. Yes, it's because here that's on how the many bottom bags. of the... That's how many bags Two to are. five, well, yeah, but I don't know if all five could play. Yes, two to five players. It says 40 to 60 minutes. I don't think it's going to take that long. Probably Especially not. with two players. Well, we're playing with all new abilities, so we'll see. So, yeah, that might slow us down a little bit. Yeah. So, we played with half of the abilities the first time we played. And now we're playing with two repeats and then all the rest new. So, we can get a good feel of all of the abilities. I like the first one. Mm -hmm. I like the first abilities and stuff. Yeah. Did you, you beat me by like two points, didn't you? Or one point? No, you don't I, th remember. I think you beat me by two points. We've we played a lot of close games recently. I mean, I like <laughs> every game we played for like the past. <laughs> but like, what I mean, like games? that was the far the last game we played was the farthest out we've been in a while. It's like a four point game. So they all have all been really close. So anyway, in this game, we are trying to basically bet on which of these eight creatures will make it to the end. They've got a cute little theme with it. It says, um, fantastic. Creatures gather on the edge of a virgin forest to celebrate the equinox. In a friendly but challenging competition, these creatures confront each other using their magical powers. Their objective is to continue living through the tales and fables that will tell of their heroism. Three of them will be remembered, while the others will sink into oblivion. Which of these creatures will become legendary? Wait for so, it! Legendary. Legendary. I mean, can you imagine a cute little bat like this with Thank stories you. being written about her? She's so cute. Yeah, this is and her name is Carmen. The, the artwork is the, uh, phenomenal. The artwork is great. The, the black and white one that I showed you is just one of the the Basic. front row cards. But the artwork for these is... Look at it. He's so cute. It's Hoot. His name is Hoot. He's so cute. He's so cute. And and what do you say, Steph? What do you say? My friend? No, you still look at your shirt. I try to befriend it and keep it as a pet. How about this guy? He's the cover. Oh, uh, he's the best. Yeah, he's but like, what about this guy? You like, try to. So cute. You try to. Befriend him. And keep it as a pet. Yeah. This guy has two friends. It's a chameleon friend and an eagle friend. Anyway, we're not playing with any of these ones. Right, so. <laughs> these are the, uh, these are all the ones we've already played with. Yeah. So, um, each player is given a bag with five stones. Here's a here's the catch: these bags, they are fantastically made. They are absolutely unnecessary. <laughs> However, they are they look pretty fantastic. Um, the stones are you know good quality. The overhead could probably be yeah. a little bit lighter, but it, I know. it's fine. Um, the black and gray are as you'd expect. They are basically black and white and gray and white. But then you got the purple stones here. There, that's a little better. So that's Steph's color. I am the blue. We are going to sew these up and put them away. But yeah, the bags, not needed. But it's fine. They're fine. Um, each player is dealt eight cards. So, let's go ahead I'll put my bag away too, and look at the overhead. So, uh, normally these are over on the left-hand side. We're going to put them over here on the right. Makes it a little bit easier for you guys to keep track of. Plus, small friend can keep track of the, uh, the one on the very bottom. This game will consist of five rounds. On each of these rounds, we are going to basically fill up the row, and when the row is filled, whichever creature scores the lowest 
and is uniquely the lowest is out. If two tie for the lowest, we're going to keep going and uh, until in this there's row, a definitive. Uh, until there's a definitive lowest. lowest, which might not be either of those. It could be another one. And then what happens? Well, poof! That creature will disappear into the oblivion and into the the <laughs> legends. And we will put this all the way down. They will not be remembered. <laughs> will not be remembered. Hey, you want to become famous? No. I think it's time to <laughs> poof. <laughs> My mods are quick. Um, <laughs> they the best. Thanks, Ray. Thanks, Ray. <laughs> um, <laughs> don't bring that weak stuff in here. Um, <laughs> want to become famous? Get banned. Um, so, <clears throat> want to become famous? Survive in this challenge and you too will become famous. What is that? Marked 11 mod? Mod love. Oh, I don't have that one. That one showed up as marked 11 mod. Oh, it didn't come up as emotes? No. Oh. No, it didn't there either. That's weird. <laughs> okay. All right, as I was saying. Um, so, um, each of us has eight cards. The, num the numbers on the cards range from zero to ten. So, there are 11 cards per suit. Okay. Uh, there are these eight creature types up here plus a chameleon so on your turn uh oh there are 14 different champions that's why we are we've taken six of them out we're playing with six new ones plus two we've played with before yep uh on your turn you are going to either uh make a regular prediction make a secret prediction reveal a secret prediction or skip so if you are going to make a regular position, you are going to take one of your five stones, of which you only get five in the entire game. Not enough. And you will either place it... Let me see one of the cards we're not using here. Don't, no, don't look. So, excuse me for a second. Well, I picked those up so she doesn't look, because I don't trust her. I'm a good person. No, because you immediately went... Well, I was going to go pick it up for no, you. No, uh, those are my cards. I didn't so, know. So, no. All right, let's pretend like this is the mouse. Um, you will either place it underneath a card that you want to bet on or on top of a card that already exists. Either way, you have made a regular prediction on that card. And then you may continue with your turn as normal. In the first round only, you can make a secret prediction. And to do that, you're going to take one of your cards in your hand and you're going to put your stone on it. So that is going to be worth five points at the end of the game if your creature survives. When you do this, remember, number one, it's the first round only. Number two, you can only ever do one of these. And number three, you are going to give up the ability to play a card in the row. This is the only time that you would skip phase two, which is when you play a card into the row. Um, the third thing you can do is to reveal a secret prediction. So at uh, any time on a phase one of my turn, I can say, you know what? I think this would be better if I revealed it. So I can now get points. I can now go ahead and say, I have five influence on this mouse. I will then, well, let's say it was, let's say it was this little gnome dude. I'm going to put it directly on that gnome dude. And it's going to be worth five influence, which is right here. So if you've got influence on a card, it's this much influence here on the side here. Base influence of five. In the first round, if you've put one here, it's four influence. Here is three influence two influence, one influence, and zero influence. There are reasons to put it down there, but I would probably recommend you not wait that long. So, Shrey is the quickest. <laughs> so, um, so that is phase one where you make or reveal a prediction. You don't have to do that, but you can do that. Uh, phase two is when you play a card. You are going to play a card from your hand into its corresponding row. If there's already a card there, you cover up the card that is there. If you have 
the most influence on that creature type, you may then activate its ability. You like that, don't you? Um, you answered time rollers the question. But Michael, why do I want influence? <laughs> I'm glad you asked time roller. You would want influence so you could do its ability. For example, if you have the most influence on the little mouse critter, let's say I played this under the mouse's spot and then I, for a regular prediction, and then I played this card in that spot, doesn't matter that it's a zero, I get that special ability, which in this case is draw three cards. That's pretty good. So draw three cards, add it to my hand. In phase three, you are going to discard cards from your hand. Here's the catch though, you can only discard cards that have been poof, uh, disappeared off out of history. So if a card has been, uh, what is that called? Eliminated. They call it eliminated. If a creature has been eliminated, then you may discard it. Um, Carmen the Bat will influence, will change that a little bit, but we'll talk about her power here in a second. Uh, during phase four, you're going to draw cards to rebuild your eight card hand. If you already have more than eight cards, you're not going to get any more. And phase five, if we have filled up a row and if we have a unique lowest number, poof, that, car, that creature will be eliminated and we're moving on to the next round, the next complete round of play. So there are five rounds in the game. By the time we get to the end, we will know which three or more creatures will remain. Um, the game will end when this bottom row is filled or when the last card has been drawn. That's what happened in our game. That's what happened in our game. So just because it's two players doesn't mean that that won't happen. It very well could. So Well, you were drawing from the mouse a lot. I was so drawing that was... from that mouse like crazy. Yeah, so... <laughs> so, um, who is... who? What are our powers? So we already talked about Carmen a little bit. Uh, Carmen's special ability is uh, when you discard creature cards, you can discard creature cards that are either in play or eliminated. You don't have to show each card that you discard to other players, but you can only discard up to three cards. So, and that'll help you draw more cards that could be useful. Uh, let's see, we got this little mushroom man. His name is Fungi. F-U-N-G-Y, Fungi. Choose another creature that has been eliminated and immediately activate its special power. Mm -hmm. You cannot activate the special power of creatures set aside before the start of the game. Okay. So <laughs> you can't fine. you can't use those. I'm gonna use the mouse in the box. <laughs> this ability. <laughs> can't do that. No. No. So we have Goatman. Choose another player who has at least three cards in hand. So I'm gonna choose Steph. Um Draw three cards from their hand and look at them. Keep one, give the other two back Boo. without showing them to anyone. That's not good. You cannot draw cards that are face down due to the power of the stag. The, the stag makes you discard half your hand face down and you can't use them until your turn, your next turn ends. So. All right. Eliminate. That's when you eliminate them with a uh, nice tasty drink. We have this gnome dude. What is his name? Hanging with my gnomies. <laughs> his name is Rubble. With Rubble, immediately place one of your prediction pebbles on any creature that does not already have a pebble on it. In any row, including previously played rows. You cannot place it on a champion card. That's these in row five. Okay. Wow. That seems really good. So, if you're playing, for example, during the fourth round, you can place your prediction pe pebble on Feather Fox in the first row if there is no other prediction pebble there. The value of this prediction is four influence points, just as if you had played it in the first round. So there's your example for pebble uh, for rubble. This is Ursus. During the game, Ursus does not have a special power, but the strength of each of his cards is like a 0.5 more. So it ranges from 0 0.5 to 10.5. Uh, in addition, 
uh, during the final scoring. If he's still in play, each player is going to score a half an influence for each of their prediction pebbles in that column. So, hey, half extra, half of a victory point. And uh, I think he's the cover of the other box of Equinox. Uh, n- no, it is this guy. That, oh, that is. This good. is the other cover. Yeah, there, yes. I know it's one of the green ones. Yes, you're <laughs> correct. This is Moss Man. Retrieve one of your prediction pebbles already placed in the column of a creature, eliminated or not. Place your pebble in front of you. If you retrieve the pebble of your secret prediction, discard that creature card, and you can make a new prediction with that pebble on a later turn. Does that mean you can make a second secret prediction? That is a good question, I think. Uh, You can only make a secret prediction in the first round. Oh, you may make one secret prediction per game. Why would you ever want to discard it? Does that mean you can only ever have one or make one? That's a little bit different. Mm. So, a little bit of ambiguity there. Oh, look at this little guy. He's cute. Uh, His name is Hopscotch. Choose a column from a creature still in play. You can exchange a visible creature card from that column for another creature card in the same column. Nice. And last but not least, you have twins. Immediately play a second card as if you had an additional phase two this turn. Phase two is when you play a card. This special power cannot be used more than once per turn. All right, I like it. Um. The Chameleon has a special power. You can play a Chameleon in any column. Uh, The catch with the Chameleon is you cannot, if if you play on top of the Chameleon, even if you have influence, the special power will not activate. All right. Am I first or are you first? first? Alexa, pick a number. No. No. Five is me. There are also um, three tree cards. There is the Ancestor and the Dryad. The Ancestor, uh, choose one creature in play, and if anybody has made a secret prediction for that animal, they must show it. I am odd. I, I I am low numbers. She is high numbers. We thought about doing odd and even, but she's odd sometimes. So, um, I let her be high and I'm low. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Um, But I am odd. Thank you for noticing. Um, If you play the Dryad, you can retrieve a visible creature card from the current round or previous one and put it in your hand. So, um, I will figure this out. Hmm. Um, if Shrey or Derek wants to do a prediction. Ooh, that's can, a good plan. We can predict. <laughs> I am going to uh, first place a pebble, then play a card. Oh, look, I have the most. I'm going to choose a player. Take three cards and keep one. Uh. Yeah, no, she doesn't like that. Probably will change everything. I guess I like it better now than later. Than later, yeah. Because I can change my mind on what I'm doing. I will take one. I will give the other two can back. Can I see what it was? Because I, I didn't memorize yes. my hand. And you, you okay. can see what yeah, I yeah. saw. Yeah, yeah. I got it. Oh, boy. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. All right, it's 101 to zero. That's so. Michael over Steph. Somebody's put 101 points in. Ugh. Ugh. No prediction? Yeah, it's, it's going on right now. You, I'm talking about you. No. No. Oh, look, you did a little froggy man. And then I draw two cards because you took one of mine. It did. 
I did took one. I took it at it. What is this? What's this? Oh, yeah. I remember that. So if I play a pebble here, she cannot also play a pebble here. She could play it here, though. Next turn, yeah. Next round. Next round. Um, and she can play on any of the other columns. Yeah, get in your predictions now. Use your channel points to see who will win. 91% to 9%. Somebody has finally jumped on your bandwagon. <laughs> Nobody believes in me. Oh, my goodness. It's fine, though. She's been beating me, guys. You should give her a chance. Now I'm winning somehow. <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. Somebody bid nine more points than... Oh, the fight is on. It's <laughs> hovering around 50-50. I don't, know. I don't know. I am just going to uh, play on old twinsy here and draw a card. Oh, bad. Bad. Hey, Tyrone, thanks for the biddies. Every bit helps. That is Every correct. bit helps. Look, it went from 29% to 30%. Oh, you earned a new 1,000 biddies badge, Ooh, Tyrone. You have contributed 1,000 bits to this channel. Con congrats. Thank That's you awesome. very much for Thank that. Thank you. Now look, now it's 56% towards you. Submissions are closing in two minutes, guys. Oh, we got a number two Moss Man. Moss Man. Uh, looks like we have a number one Fungi. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't know what to do. I, also I should get in some bids because it's like a four point bid at this point. I could play a secret bid. All right, I'll do a secret bid. You know what? I think, I I think that's that my too. whole turn though. Yes, that is your whole turn. All right, that's a secret bid. My you whole are turn. correct. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, I too will do a secret prediction. Thank you, Scott, for the biddies. Biddies. Hype train. Michael, you have to get your... Oh, there's a hype train. <laughs> there's a hype train. Thank you, Shrey. Had to get the hype train started. Will NASA be able to launch their rocket tonight, or will it be another scrub? That is a good question. Let's see. I want... Oh, we got BGG TV raiding with a party of 30. Hey, guys. Hello. Welcome. Welcome. Hey, we're going to play Sleeping Gods tonight. Aldi, I know you love it. Oh, so, yes. So, yes. <laughs> Gonna be playing Sleeping Gods. Hello, Lordy Bun. Hello. Uh, hello. Derek says, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Thanks for the hey, biddies. Hey, we have, the, we you have know, a this hype is the train. best time for a hype train to be going on. It's in BGG TV raids. <laughs> you get all the new emotes right now. There are new Twitch emotes. <laughs> new Look, Twitch emotes. I have gotten these new Twitch emotes. <laughs> I've gotten these new Twitch emotes since the new ones have started. Yeah. Look at those. Oh, yes. Thanks, BG. Thanks, Aldi. Thanks, Aldi. Yay. So this is, Eight the, months. this is the best time to have a hype train. Plus, if you get to a level four hype train, no, but not, not level five, then she might get a spider. We're, and we're, we all want oh that. God. Aldi, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Aldi. Oh, you gifted one to Derek Wigsby. Woo. And Dan, Dan gets a and subscription. And Timon. And Timon. Look at that. That's really great. Those are some great peeps. Steeped Games, Caffeinated Canuck. Nice. Everybody loves emotes. Yeah, Derek has one of the new parrots. Thanks, Allie. That's fantastic, Al. Yeah. Oh, wait. Do I have... I have seven cards. I need... Oh, no. I played one. I get one back. Did you get yours? I think Steph? so. Yeah. All right. I didn't get mine. And then what? <laughs> well, no. If we if we do a level four hype train, we're going to get a spider. And then I'll be sad forever. <laughs> forever. <laughs> The level four <laughs> modes are so bad. Shrey, don't do it! <laughs> Shrey! Defoob gets a give sub. Yay! And Pop Monkey. Pop Monkey Kestrel. is uh, one of our new our new uh, our new followers. Thanks, Shrey. Woohoo! And Matthew Ryan, all these great people. We are at level sub. four. Everyone stop. Everyone stop. Actually, I mean we do want the level five ones. 
<laughs> I mean, we do want those. Oh my goodness. But it would be funny if she got the spider. Because you can't remove them. It would be so funny. Um, so It might happen by if the you time. Love, if you love Steph. Oops, sorry. If you sorry. love Steph. No, don't say it, sorry. If you love Steph, you should donate bits. If, if you love to antagonize Steph, stop. No. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> oh my goodness! If you, if you want to make her sweat, go up to the border. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me sweat. <laughs> Playing a game. So funny! All right, I think it's you because oh. you did yours and I did mine. Okay. I've got mine way over here, All so right. hidden. Hidden. All right. Um, dinger. What's this? I should make a prediction. Though. We That's have like... tons of uh, tons of bit rainbows going on the side there. It's so good. Well, I'll go. Look at that! They do want to antagonize you. I I know. Believe me. Oh, you're going on this one? Yeah. What? Why? What? It's not there, and the likelihood of it going away this turn is. Fine. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Oh, what to do now? You have messed me up. <laughs> oh my goodness. I messed you up? Yeah, you have messed me up. Why did I mess you up? Hey, thanks for following. Yay. If you get all the five, they start to give you the other. Oh, that's true. So you might as well go for the five. Oh, we got two follows. Thanks for following. Thanks, guys. I mean, you might as well go Yay. for the five at this point, right? Am I right? I think I'm right. Totes. Totes, Totes. right. <laughs> Anything but spiders. Anything but spiders. <laughs> Anything but spiders. Do I want to place another one of these? I sort of do. Um, Aldi, have you played Colossal Arena? This is the this is Equinox. Equinox. It's Equinox? Sort of, yes. Both. The the new Slash old Reiner Knizia game. <laughs> <laughs> Rethemed. Rethemed. Spider friend. Spider no friend. I played Titan the Arena like 20 years ago. Same game. That's right. That's what Dan was saying. <laughs> yes. It's a, yeah. Well, so I actually haven't played that or Colossal Arena. Mm -hmm. But I don't think the rules have changed that much. But I can't be sure. I am actually going to place on the mushroom, and then I'm going to. What's this? I'm gonna I'm gonna chameleon it. Are you really? Yeah, I did. Are I you just did. Sure, it. you want to do that? I did it right now. Um. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and play that zero mushroom right there. Oh yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. You don't want it. Uh, no, I don't want it. You're right. <laughs> Princess Mononoke, the game cover. I know, it's so good. I'm going to place this and then put oh, the 4 it's... under it. Pulling this back. Thanks for wasting your zero. I appreciate it. Yep, happy to help. <laughs> I mean, it, I, I... It's not it, bad. It doesn't it's, matter to It doesn't me. matter. I felt like it was an opportunity. It's a good opportunity. It was a good opportunity. What do I do now? It's a really good question. Let's do... I don't know. I just don't know. What do I want to do? Do that. Doesn't Can matter. I do that? Yeah, it doesn't much matter. I want to do... Nothing really this. matters. A five. Yeah. Does it matter? Nope. Nothing really matters. I'll mushroom, mushroom, snack. And snack. then... Snack. 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 Oh my god, I've earned a level 4 emote. Is it a spider? <laughs> I got uh, the cat. It I got the so cat. It was so funny. I, I did not one. get the cat. What did I get? You got that yesterday. <laughs> did you get the spider? No, you did not. <laughs> no! Are you kidding me? 
<laughs> I got the spider! No! <laughs> no! No, 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 no! Thanks, everyone! <laughs> Oh, it's so funny. Get it out of my chat. <laughs> Get it out of my chat. Get it out. Oh my goodness, that is so funny. No. Yes, it's so good. No. All Bad. right, so if I, I must play if I can play. Oh my god, that means my next level four is going to be a spider. No. So I don't. Now I know. Funny. Now I know. No more level four hype trains for me. <laughs> I'm right out. <laughs> right out. <laughs> <laughs> right out. Uh, I don't want to play any of these. Me either. I forget what the tree does. <laughs> what does the tree do? I don't know. I'm going to I'm going to play the 10 here. He leaves. <laughs> that what the tree does? The tree? The tree leaves. Alright, did it. No, but really, what does a tree do? What does what tree do? There are three trees in the game. The big tree and the two female the trees. The big tree, you name one of these, and if anybody, anybody, has played that as their secret, they must reveal it. Oh. Uh, the female tree... Uh, take back a visible creature card from the current round or a previous one and put it in your hand. Mm. Um. Let's see. What do I want to do? Make like a tree and get out of here. Oh, I don't want to go in different directions than you. I'm going to do... Mm. Mm. <laughs> She's going to do... Mm. Oh, man. I kind of like the ability to just discard things. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to do that over there. Twins. You're going to twins up? Yeah. Twins up! Twins no! Up. I hate you! <laughs> that needs to stop. <laughs> that needs to stop. <laughs> That's bad. That's so funny. That's though. really, really bad. Yeah, it's so funny though. It's not funny. It's so funny. It's not funny. It's so good. It's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> By stop, you mean add channel points for Michael to drop spiders. Slab a like. No. <laughs> Slab a like. Slab a like. No. <laughs> Spider reveal at 10 million subs. <laughs> uh, <laughs> why you gotta be this? Because it's funny. <laughs> why you gotta be this? Why you gotta be this? I like to be complicated. Uh, yeah, and you did it. Yeah, it's fine. <clears throat> uh, this is gonna make things interesting. Because the more the more stones you put out there, the more I want them to die. <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, I know. There's a problem though. Okay. Because there's two zeros out, so oh, it's not oh, gonna matter. Oh, I know. We're oh, gonna make know. one of them not be a zero. Before these happen. It's not funny until all the channel regulars have it. No, we're not letting that happen. <laughs> oh, yes, we are. Wait one hour. No. Then high train again. No. Every, every leg helps. <laughs> no, it does not. Every every arachnid helps. No, no, it, no, it does not. Now I'm, like, getting itchy. <laughs> it's so bad. What's that? No. <laughs> I need to I need to play a card. Yes, play something. <laughs> I am playing something. Um I am going to I'm gonna slap a like. Slap a like. 
Oh, that doesn't do what I thought it did. I thought that did something different. Uh, uh what? Uh, I wish I had better cards. Oh, I know. I do not have the better cards. <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for the hype train, by the way. Even though it got Michael a spider. So I do not thank you for that. That's awesome. And I'm going to take a card. You. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. I have three stones left. And I want to use one of them, but I don't want to use one of them. That's fine. I don't mind if you take these down here. That's, that's Yeah. Fine. It's all about killing your stones. But you know what? I am going to do this, I think. No, I'm not. Yeah, I mean, I could do a hype train by myself. I can choo choo that thing at the level four. Because <laughs> mm. Scott said, do you hear how many points I just bought? <laughs> it would be worth it. Mm. What are you doing? I don't got many options, that's I, for sure. That's my problem is that I don't have options. I have some options, but I don't want to help you and other things. I don't have options. A zero? Yeah, I don't have options. Wow. We're going to be yes. in round one for a while. If that's the case, I will go here and do this. And so now... What did you do? I went there. Oh, it was already one on and there. And I could discard up to three cards. Yes. Yes. Okay, I'll just put them down like this. It seems good. And then I draw four cards. Then you draw it. Maybe I'll find something good. <laughs> yeah, Probably not. That'd be great. Yeah. This might be the longest round one with all the zeros out. Yeah, all the zeros are out. <laughs> so, yeah. I got plans, I guess. <laughs> yeah? I don't know. I don't have plans. You do have plans because you controlling the twins. I see your plans. Not really. Okay. Um, because all I have to do is moss man it and I, I will be able to pick it right back up. Moss man. Boss man, excellent. Woo, woo, woo. Woo, woo, woo. I think I'm going to have to... What does Rubble do? Immediately place one of your pebbles on one that does not already have a pebble on it in any row. But I'd have to have it to get it, so. Uh, hmm. Tis you. Sure. I'll do this. That's a seven. Yep. And then I'm going to discard stuff and things and stuff. I draw four. You... Yes. Ugh. Hmm. Lot of lot of no options here. Cool. I am going to I 
I could take this away, but then it would be one, two, three, four zeros. That's a lot of zeros. That's a lot of zeros. And I don't think that really helps anybody, to be honest. Dad says, this game was originally Grand National Derby in Germany, then Titan at the Arena Galaxy, the Dark Ages, and Colossal Arena in the U.S. Fine. I'm on wow. three of your cards. Oh, boy. All right. That uh, was three. It is. What did you see? What do you see? I see these three. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Mm hmm. Yeah, Dan. I would have thought the same, but we just keep playing. We we're not we're not finding a. You took the pink. Yes. Pink. You took the pink. I took your pink. That was rude. Yeah. I will actually play that there. Yeah. Sure you will. All right. And it doesn't end. It's because we keep putting all the zeros out and there's no definitive loser. Yes. All three of your cards. Wait, I didn't draw. Let's see. What did I get? Ugh. Every time, every time. Well, we had a hype train going, so that yeah, took a little you while. You missed the hype train. Wow. I think I might sit on that eight and a half. Seems good. Yeah, it does. For me. Yeah, it does. Um. Well, I might as well do this because you keep pulling it. And it doesn't matter because it's not going to be a loser. I keep pulling it. From my hand. Oh. When you pull the goat. Pulling the goat. <laughs> Dad's like, I still don't understand hype trains. And I would appreciate if no one ex would explain it. Okay. Done. Oh, it's going to be explained. Oh, it'll be explained. <laughs> Well, 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 well. I don't really have a lot of good options here. Okay. <laughs> We're going to be out. We're, all of, the, all We're of them are going to survive. It's going to be ridiculous. All of them are going to survive because this is not going to make it out of the first round. <laughs> They're all legendary to us. Yes. I think I will. <laughs> Matt explained it to Dan anyway, so it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pull this away. Zoop. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, that's fine. Um... Bad, bad. Do you draw up or you don't get to draw? I've got eight. I'll put it back. Discarding cards. Let's mm -hmm. see. What do I want to discard? Three. I draw four. Mm hmm. See that? Yep. You. Yep. A lot of these zeros came out all at once. All at once. It sucked. At least we got a rainbow. 
We got the full rainbow. Well, that's because you put it out there like that. It wasn't me. It was you. Probably. Um, I am going to put an eight on this, Ooh. which lets me put out a second one. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to put out an eight on this, which will close Kill out the, the frog. frogs. The frog has been eliminated. Poof. Poof. Super poof. Wow. Yeah. All right. So that was big. That, that, that was big dead frog. Oh, what are you doing? Nothing moving. I need, on. Yeah, no, I need it. All right. You. Me. Um... Looks like you want the moss man to happen. Or I just want it out of my hand. One or the other. It's possible. Oh, I could have discarded the frog that I had left over. Boy, this is not great. Discarding a frog. Yep. Drawing two. Yep. Did it. Yep. Yep. Um. Four and a half Barra. 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 Hmm. I don't know what to do. I know what to do. Do you? Yeah. Cool. You want to see the artwork, don't you? Well, yeah. I see that. When in doubt, surrender. Yeah. No, I, I'm not I, gonna, I, not I gonna could, surrender. I could surrender. I do not want to surrender. Should do that. I'm gonna get that out of my hand. That's rude. And by rude, you mean smart. It is a chameleon. I like your, him. For your goat. That's fantastic. That is, that is a chameleon for my goat. <laughs> wow. 
Got a few follows too. That was good. It's good. Thanks for your following. Yeah, I think uh, I think there is a winning plan, and I am not following it. Is there a winning plan? Yeah, I think so. Am I following it? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's following it. Nobody's going to win. I am going to place this and this and take this back into my hand. Thanks. Appreciate that. Mm. <laughs> um... Sure, I'll put that over there. Three. No, I meant to put him there. I'm all in on the bear. Mm hmm See, I got two. I got two on the bear. If he if he survives the whole time. Yeah, exactly. 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 If he survives. You're assuming he will survive. Senor Goat. Senor Goat. All right. A lot of threes out now. That's right. Sure. Nice. You sort of want that, I think. You don't know me. Oh, uh, yeah, I do at the moment. I sort of I don't do. think you know me. Yeah. Hanging with my know me. Hanging with your know me. <laughs> I don't think you know me. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of options. Discarding Senor Frog. Senor Frog. Zero. Yep, there's a zero. You are correct. There's a six. <laughs> That's a three. <laughs> wow. Wow. I got a lot of threes. A three. This is pretty fabulous. It's fabulous. If I've got this right. Oh, no, let's play a second card. Let's play a second card. Not going to do that. Well, now I've revealed my, my plan. My plan. Slap a like. Slap a like. 
reveal my plans level eight. Well, sure, you can't end it. I'll just get rid of this dude. <laughs> That's a four. Yep. And well, this is fantastic. And that's the end of that. Slap a like. Slap a like. Oh, I could have placed this if I want to place it. No, I'm going to keep it. Yeah. So, uh, poof. He disappears. That's zero points for you. Yep, that is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <gasps> Ocho. <clears throat> As you. Round three. So what Fine. is this ability? You may take one of your tokens and place it anywhere you want that does not have one. But you have to place it and then place a token. You have to have it and then place it. Hey, Panic! Yeah, all right. Sure. But you don't have another one. It doesn't matter. I mean, I there's nothing I can do, well, those, so oh, I just want the are, game to end at this are, point. Those are dead? At right now. I'm guessing those are so, dead. So, yeah. Well, then that's fine, because I will do this. Cool. And take it. Uh, 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 uh. All right. There's my ability. I am currently... Hello, panic. Currently activating my ability. One... Two, three. Discarding these three. Taking four. You're like, doesn't matter. It doesn't. It doesn't matter. I'm going to get zero points this game, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> so. You don't know. At this point, it's just over. You don't know. So it doesn't matter what you play. All right, there's a mushroom. There's two bears that are dead. Draw three cards to replace. Um, Aldi, the, the chameleon can't kill a column, but it was the lowest value. He put the, he put the one out, which killed the column. Because the column it was, was the lowest. filled. It was the lowest. I thought all of the low chameleons had been played, but clearly. Clearly there was they one weren't. left. And it, it ruined me, so. So five will kill this dude right here. Um, do I have any to discard? I have frog dude, frog dude, and that's all I got. One, two. What'd you just do? Did you discard? They were dead cards. Oh. All right. Hmm. 
Uh, six. Yeah, this uh, this game has proven to be really not great with two. Um, we played I yesterday. Like it. it wasn't bad. This game has gone terribly wrong. So that's it, just because of. Yeah, doesn't matter. Like literally, you can play anything. I'm literally gonna get no points this game. So <laughs> you will win no matter what you do. Uh, play a three, discard some stuff. One, two. Three. Draw four. One, two, three, four. But it makes a pretty rainbow board at the end. It does make a pretty rainbow board. Uh, this isn't bad. Play an eight. Killing this guy. Uh, did I have any to kill before that? No. Uh, Is that it? One. It will be when you draw this card. Because there are no more cards left. As soon as that draws, I believe that is it. Double, I'm going to double check. Uh, or when the draw deck is empty. So all four of these creatures survive. Um, so looking at the secret, which even if they're not revealed, they're worth five. Revealed is five. Unrevealed is five. Um, I had another twin. And you had? The bear. Another bear. Obviously. Wow, you went not just in on the bear, you went all in on the bear. So, you got four points. <laughs> Sorry, Steph. Thanks, Thanks for, following. for following Heavy Cardboard. Oh, how's it going, Hi. Ed? Or Jess. I Ed or Jess. <laughs> Ed and Jess. Ed and Jess. Cool. cool. Ed and Jess. All right. So I got four. Michael got uh, uh, a million and a half. Five, nine, 13, 16, 18. Wow. Points. Who needs points? 18 to four. I mean, once you go all in, if you go all in and somebody plays that uh, uh, one chameleon at the end, it's just, yeah. it can kill you right then. So... I mean, what I, don't, am I, I like to it do? even with two. It's cutthroat. Well, not go all in. What am I? Well, what else am I supposed to do? I didn't have a cool power to move my tokens around. Like whatever. You could so. take it. You got this, and I was like, "Hmm, that's gonna be really strong for you." So that's why I intentionally took the goat back to double up on this, and I was hoping you didn't secret it because if you secreted it, all you have to do is go, "Ha ha!" Reveal. That's nine points total. Yeah. So. Got to finish the prediction. Yeah, I did. so Michael won <laughs> Winky Face. It was close. <laughs> what was the score again? <laughs> it's got the blur filter on it. Do you see the blur filter? <laughs> she even she was thinking about even doing a double too. <laughs> it was close. <laughs> close. <laughs> <laughs> nice blur filter. <laughs> uh, oh my goodness. So who is it? Jess or Ed? I st it's we still both. have not we still have it's both. <laughs> right. They're both sitting right. on top of the keyboard. No move! <laughs> hey Edward. Hey Edward. Um, <laughs> Michael <laughs> equals Jess, Steph <laughs> equals me. <laughs> Where Jeff Jess just comes in and goes. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Gotcha. <laughs> hey, uh, we had a much closer game the other day. Oh, yeah, it was well, really so close. Well, so it wasn't as weird as this because the first round was, like, forever long. This was weird. It was really weird first round. But these round, went much so... faster than our other game. Well, yeah, because the first round took forever because we got zeros piled on zeros and zeros and we couldn't... Well, we could have had... We almost had threes piled on threes later on yeah that's what killed me and almost so. then twos piled on twos on another row and i'm like that could be a problem because like 
yeah, there it is. There's a two on a two, and I'm thinking, eh, I don't like that too much. I just uh, I thought maybe you you secreted good old uh, Carmen here, Carmen the Bat. Although I had a bunch of really good green cards, so I'm like, I can I can babysit that the whole way and it'd yes. be fine, but it didn't it, work out that way. No, so. the chameleon always throws it. Um, no, I I really like it. That's good. I, um, I mean, I know I, you I, don't I, like I it. I would want to play it with more people, just because I there was there was one card that left me sour in the first game we played, and <laughs> obviously the goat left me sour this game. That was which one left horrible. you sour in the oh it's the one where um the hoot. He's so cute, though. He's, <laughs> He's so cute. With Hoot, um, select a player and choose a creature that's still in play. And um, a player and a creature. That player must give you a creature, a corresponding creature card if they have one. If they don't have one, they have to show you their entire hand. So I didn't have a card that my and I saw for. And he got the information hand. of my whole hand. I I'm got like, her whole hand. And I went... Uh, <laughs> it was awful. Like was... that was terrible. So yeah, she did not give a hoot. I did not give a hoot. Sour goat. But it's a really cute card. <laughs> it was it, for me. It was a spicy goat. <laughs> That's his favorite food truck. Oh no, the steaming goat. That's a steaming the steaming goat. goat is my favorite food truck. <laughs> so they have a menu item that they no longer advertise on their menu called the goat. And no actual goats are harmed in the making of this food. <laughs> However, if you order a goat, number one, they know you're a, a old timer for this food truck because they don't advertise it anymore. Number two, it's basically you give them ten dollars, they put whatever they want on your sandwich. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck. So no actual goat week. <laughs> Legendary. <laughs> Did, does he survive after it though? Legendary. Does, <laughs> So far, Michael survived. I have survived. They have given me some really good, <laughs> some really good, interesting things. I tell them no peanut butter, though they're not ever going to put peanut butter on it. So yeah, trivia about me. I don't like peanut butter. Um, What's wrong with you? I just don't like it. All right, um, finish so, your yeah. thoughts about this game. I think it's got good strategy. It's not just a, just another abstract game. I, I like the interactions. I like. Yeah, they, you know, I you like can just, most of the interactions. You can eliminate. I love the artwork, obviously. Well, if you don't like the interactions, take the ones that the interactions well, you now, don't like. Now I know. Now you know. Take the take the goat or take whatever. Like, I didn't like you having the power of Carmen. It's really strong. Yeah, it's I was just really all the cards strong. You wanted. Yeah, everything. <laughs> like, oh, I've got a low one. Uh, like, a two. It's not bad keeping because sometimes there's a one or a zero. That's fine. If you got ones and zeros, discard them dudes. If you've got, you know, high of something that she wants, get rid of them. You're not going to need them. So, yeah. <laughs> that Knitsia guy might amount to something someday. <laughs> I, the, the jury's still out as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> oh, burn. Burn. Hey, I love it's, Knitsia games it's in general, so. Fine. I definitely uh, prefer the other type of I, Knitsia games to this one. I, I joke a little bit. It's his stuff is is not bad. It's just it's okay. So Aldi's asking us if there are any differences in the game besides as the covers. As far as I know, it's just the cover difference. Yeah. So you'll either get the stag cover or the moss man cover. <laughs> It'll look like this, but green. So the the green sides instead of the purple sides uh, both are attractive i think uh, of course steph likes the pretty rainbow colors God, i wish so. all i wish all games looked this pretty it was re it's really with all the cute critters everybody i just the, that's the artwork the colors everything about it is really nice um i like i, I like even how, these bags that are unnecessary even the unnecessary bags <laughs> even the bags that you don't you know what need I'm, at all i mean all the Color, player colors still the same? I don't know. That I, no that I don't know. I know this game. I don't even know the differences between the old games either. Um, I, I I remember in Colossal Arena, they had things like the Cyclops and the this and that and the other. Um, I like this theme. 
uh, all of the little myth- mythological fairy tale creatures. Yeah. And you're trying to find out which one will, you know, become legendary. No, 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 no. Separate. Oh, you want separate. Separate. Because you're going to have... New- you got to keep them separated. You got to keep them separated because each game you're going to have to... Uh, Pick the creatures you want. Oh yeah, we have we have chameleons scattered throughout. I ended up discarding the tree, the elder tree, because I didn't even want to bother guessing who you had. Oh, you discarded him? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I like the trees either. <laughs> well, I mean, it, it's a good delay tactic. It's better than playing a, a seven on one of your opponent's critters. Not necessarily, because I I knew I had a lower card to play. Just saying. I'm just saying. It, I mean, whatever. I would I would <laughs> rather delay with something that gives me a card back than delay with something that strengthens one of your creatures, even if I've got a lower one, because that wastes two of my turns just to undo what I just did. Eh. But I mean, if you have a six out there and I had the ten, and there's no way that a six was going to lose the round anyway, playing a ten doesn't matter. Right. So you use those as delay tactics, and right. You you know you do that. Uh, that one was the. So, yeah, I like the stag cover better as well. But I also can't imagine any differences between them. Either. I had a ten and a nine of the uh, twins in my hand. Uh, didn't start with them. But. Yeah, the twins can be really strong, which is what I thought you were going to do. Um, it's just it, like, bing, bang, it's out. I'm like, yeah. It's, I think no matter what I did, my my stuff was, the bear was going to lose. Well, bear doesn't have powers. It's just sheer points if you can hold it. That's the catch. If you can hold it. If you can hold it. Why make all those golem editions? What Gollum editions? Well, the Gollum editions is actually the same game, but just with different art of Spice Road. Oh, those. Yeah. Right. Right. Why make the Gollum editions? Because the artwork is better or different (laughs) for people who want that artwork. Uh, Aldi prefers the theme of Gollum. Uh. I also... Prefer the same? Yeah. I'm putting things away for you. (laughs) Sorry. Because people will pay for them. Yeah. (laughs) It's all money. I mean, let's be honest. (laughs) That's why they do it. And I don't blame them. I mean, that's... But they make quality games, Plan B, so... Yeah. Yeah. I mean, if this interests you, then play it. (laughs) I mean, I like it. I definitely want to play it with more people. You just left this. You left your hand. <laughs> Just undone. Good luck. Good luck. Yeah, so I'll sort this and uh, <laughs> we'll be right back with Sleeping Gods. That's right. We'll be right back. Right back. Right back. Right back.